Making a game more random is a nice way to let your players get immersed in the world they're currently a part of. That's why some features should be randomized. For example, it could be an item and the location of it. In the first round, player could find a key in the office and on the second, this exact item could be placed in the bedroom. But my case is different. I wanted to randomize the flash effect on the screen that is connected to the thunder. You can see the rain in my game. And to make it more immersive, I've added the thunder. You can see the flashing effect on the screen with an audio part connected to it. And I wanted the time between each and every thunder to be randomized. So how can we do that? Let's get back to the code. On my rain scene, I've got a timer that is set to auto start with a wait time of five seconds. In the script, in my function ready, I've got the variable next wait time equals randy 31 plus 20. And this exact line will give us a number between 20 and 50. But but why is that? To be precise, the random part of it is here with the 31, but we always add 20 to it. So the lowest possible number, even if it will be zero, will still be 20 because of this plus 20. And the highest possible will be those two, 50. And from the Godot documentation, we can learn the range of the run the function that is here. And that maximum number is very big. And that's why we need that model operator here to limit the scope of this function. Later, I use this variable variable for my timer with timer dot set wait time which will change this parameter on ready to this random number and this timer on timeout will call a thunder strike here Thunderstrike function will again create another random number, will play an audio animation that is this white screen on the camera and as the last part set wait time to next wait time. And this logic makes our Thunderstrike a random event that happens every 20 to 50 seconds in our game. If you want to learn more about this Thunderstrike effect then click the video in the top right corner. I hope that this feature could make your game even better. Let me know in the comment if you've enjoyed the video. Don't forget to hit a like and subscribe button. Thank you for your time and have a good day. Bye for now.